Okay, round two, and looks like there's a bit of an imbalance here. Uh, there are 17 players on r rare on Pinor and only 14 on Robin. Can we please have, have some guys move, or I will have to restart the server? It might be best if I restarted the server. There we go. Mission begins in 10 seconds. There we are. 13 to thir 15 to 15 players. We're doing well. Now, what's up, Tom? You look a bit worried. Right. Each team has to destroy the opponent's team's robots to gain reactor modules or energy. You harvest energy by walking near them or on them. This then gets taken back to a central reserve, like is currently the case with Red Team. They they're seeing blue robots taking energy. Now, there are three types of robots. A-bots, B-bots, C-bots. A-bots give the least amount of energy, B-bots give medium amount of energy, and the C-bots give the most amount of energy. That's why they have crowns. Um, now, when a team has accumulated 300 energy, they win the game after 44 seconds. Now, you can also steal energy from the opponent's uh, reactor core where all their energy is stored, so you can steal for it from the bank. Now, it doesn't. It takes a bit of time to actually steal from the uh, main energy source, so you have to stand there for a while. At the moment, though, it does seem as if, you know, uh, Red Team is kind of running away with the game at the moment, and... Oh, what's this? Blue Team's making a steal! They stolen all your money. Now Fasto is figuring out a way to get out and around. Oh, there he goes. Okay, now that at reactor core though is in the open. It's past the lasers. Now can anybody else on blue team really help out with that? And oh no, unlucky they're fast though. Rabbit Collie was on that. But yeah, red team are now worried. This is playing putting the enemy on defensive. They're now going to stop attacking you and think about keeping their core. Otherwise, all their hard work is just gone. Well, this is kind of a scout job, really, with this kind of thing. Also, incidentally, I can't see the timer on that um, thing. Maybe it's a bit of a problem. But in any case, though, let's see what's going on up front. Blue team is struggling its way in. They have actually now gone back on the offensive and actually got some points themselves now. Looking good for them. Nope, there is no timer. Um, this game doesn't need a timer. It only times in to when um, one team has managed to get uh, enough energy. Oh, nice work from Lazy Mob. Takes up Robin before he can flodge up because he used Backburner. The energy is located inside the robots. The reactor cores are way back at the end of the enemy base. Like past the, past the sea bots, you see a laser fence. And you've got to run past that laser fence. And all you do is stand on it. You stand on it and you pick up energy. But you've got to like wait around to pick up all the energy. Now, in any case, I Red have got their m money back. Now, where is Tom? Which team is he on? Let's see if I can help him out here. There's Tom. Currently dead. Uh, I didn't help. Now, the thing is, you do want to try and steal stuff. Remember, don't try using the front door. There's an under gantry area where you can get into the base from underneath. And that really helps. If you can get it on that way, you can get in from a side door, which is less obvious. And then you can go into an un underwater area, go underwater the entire time, and then emerge near the uh, area, like GBK is doing. Unfortunately, he got lasered. Uh, but nice attempt there to try and steal. I don't think there's actually 10 energy you can steal. Um, the robots. Okay, have I mentioned that you need to destroy the robots? Like, it's kind of a big deal. Yes, you, you... Yeah, destroy the robots and harvest the energy from them. That's the what you do.
Yes, you rotate through all A bots, then C bots, then C bots. Well, to be fair, the textures aren't finished yet. Uh, but that just takes time. You can't just basically say a map is bad because you get lost. Yes. The way this is, this is complicated in terms of rules. Snowplow is complicated in terms of tactics. And by delivery, they should not have left out Snowplow. Yeah, this is turning into how to play uh, Asteroid. I've done commentary on Asteroid before, but I swear you guys have forgotten everything. Oh, oh, oh. And looks like somebody's stolen all of Blue's money. <laughs> Faster is not a happy bunny. Oh, by the way, you can't get through back through that door. It's a one-way door. You can get in real easy, but you have to run out the long way around. Um, they did actually send... They did have a no-entry sign there before, but they took it down for some reason. Oh, well, what's this? Oh, nice what Dr. Frobisher are fanning there. Clobber out people with that Widowmaker. They aren't stealing my energy. This is my energy, nobody else's. Now, why is all going on? Could Mads there still making an effort on the medium box? All the lovely energy. All the lovely, lovely energy is being read. Ah, oh, it looks like Red have managed to get half nearly halfway now. Beat the, beat, the, beat the shit out of the bots. Steal their energy. Yeah, beat the, take the energy from them. And that's it. Just keep kill bots until you win. Unless you steal the energy. But then you've got to defend, you see. It works both ways. You've got to defend against the enemy stealing yours. And ultimately, they can steal your um, thingy, so... Yeah. You can steal the enemy in... If you steal the enemy in uh, uh, thingy, then you can do that. in red base at the moment. This thing's in commotion. Also, nobody's using any advanced engineering at the moment. No troll engineering. Because I could show you guys a thing or two with troll engineering. I mean, uh, GBK knows what's up. I think GBK's played this game mode before. And I know some lovely, lovely locations you can put nice teleports to really annoy the enemy team. In the water is one. There's also some nice, obscure, out of the way areas which people don't tend to look in. But if you can get a teleporter up. Oh! <laughs> All of Blue's money's been stolen again! Now you can't go that way, Kunmad. There he goes. Tiny thief. Uh oh, there's a there's baby rage there, but oh oh no, destroyed there, and oh, the entire blue team just turns up. Yeah, blue team is playing advanced defense of their core, but the prob this is the problem though. Now this is the way the map is designed. You see, the core is right at the back there. Now you can stop people stealing your stuff, but if they keep taking it from your bots, you will lose the game. You have to defend as much territory as you can. Ooh. Now, from the looks of it, 
Looks like uh, Blue are breaking into, you know. Blue are broken into Red's stuff, I think. I'm not sure. There, okay, they got their money back. Red are still ahead, though. I may have to, may have to restart the server and get you guys to, you know, play again, actually, because I need to show you how to um, engineer in this map. Maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> Look at this, that red team, though. This is what they're doing lovingly, actually. They're doing really, really well. Somebody's stealing all the intel again! Dr. Phobia Shafanning, uh, somewhat beleaguered there. Having to defend intel. I am I am loving this. <laughs> ah, looks Balaika there. I think knows how to play this. Unfortunately, being a heavy in that little vent area isn't healthy because you can't actually move and crouch and shoot. Oh, faster there. Just gets the drop on him. Only just. Yes, interesting things going on at the moment. Blue team are finding new and interesting ways red are, red are getting in. Well, it looks like blue team are coming back, though. They're actually managing to, you know, bring back this game. But a big steal from here, here right now, though, could upset the balance. Ferret. Our core is red. Let me check. Well, all I can say is graphical glitch, most probably. <laughs> Unlucky the Jiba K. Kinda only breaks in though, to be fair. Oh my god, red team are breaking into blue team's area so hard at the moment. They just will not leave that thing alone. <laughs> blue team are catching up though. Red team's lead isn't as dominant as it used to be though. We're seeing some stuff here and there. Now, what's wrong with Doomsday? You guys seem to really hate certain games. And looks like Red is going for an offensive. Get them bots, boys. Grab the gold. And remember, offensive engineering is always good. Oh, nice one from Lazy Mole there. That's all, that's all back burner tactics right there. Getting around the outside and just work it from there. Oh, and Farso just clobs him right there and then.
Now I think it's where Ron Whale is. Now that's a lovely area for an aggressive teleporter. You know. Nice out of the way. Actually out of sight as well. And if you can get a teleporter into the enemy base, you can just keep the offensive rolling. I am going to encourage as much engineering as necessary. Aggressive engineering and dumping enemies behind is a noble thing to do. Making it so it seems upset by the fact that they can't defend properly. Oh no, baby rage, no. Looks like uh, Red Team is very busy guarding the underground passages as well. They're not letting Blue Team get in that way. Taking more energies. They're catching up, blue team. They're doing well. I think their, their defense is planned properly. Oh, nice work there from base scroll. Just half of them up there. They're almost equalizing. And here comes the Uber. And oh dear god, I think blue team are actually now overtaking. This is looking good. And actually, who's got two dom? Zyder ran in with three doms, I'm not going to keep an eye on that, so, and so is bad. Okay, two at three right now. Zyder has got four? Okay, Zyder has got four. Can he hold it? And I think that's a hold. Yep, there we go. Looks at so far 196 one to 195. Definitely a core cap right now could swing the game. What are you going to think about core cap is as well? When it gets to this point, you don't need to steal all of it, you need to steal enough. If you can do that, you can actually still swing the game in your favor because what happens is they take you take your theirs away so they can't they're waiting for them. And you've advanced that much. So now let's say um, blue team gets breaks in and steals 131 energy, then they've got game. Ah, GBK, yes. Uh, Bonk does not make you vulnerable to laser beams. Laser beams, uh, you can't dodge. It does? Then how did you die? Oh. 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 Why do people say this is not TF2? The guns still fire the same, the classes are still the same, the map looks fine, the engine is still the same, but it's just a different game mode. Now you guys want you know, always like diversity and new stuff from Valve, but they make a new game mode for you. No, it's not right. They like payload race and apparently people get umbrage over that. Now, in any case, 205 to 169, 169, yeah, blue team's coming back, but they've got to try and get the lead somehow, they're getting towards the end stages. Let me put it this way, one thing I like about this game is, right, you've got to try and defend all you can, because if you don't, the enemy will sneak up on you bit by bit. Like blue team are now, you know, they're doing very nicely, like they're sneaking up on red. They're not careful. Scouts on red team. Yeah, they seem to have a lot of scouts on them. I think they're trying to steal your energy.
Now at the moment though, 205 to 184, blue team can tip the balance, the red team can still win this game, neither of them seem, I think both of them are trying to go for a uh, cap here. 100 points will do, that's all they need to steal away, and they get to the lasers, that's great. I mean, you get if you can get the thing to the point B area, suddenly the entire surge of the team will move up and try and grab that. Oh, what's this? Lovely, lovely cause there from bad there. Uh oh, he's looking dangerous. Oh, and blue team might be stealing game here. Well, Red is fighting back. Oh, crikey. Okay, looks like Blue Team's back in the saddle again. Fast those fears are green being dissuaged right now. Now, this is getting tense. This is what I'm saying, you know, the steel start really kicking into play here. Now, as the teams now start trying to defend their... Oh, wait, what's this? Somebody's stealing your money! Oh, criminy! Base scroll, biggest thief EU. Does he have enough? Not enough. There, he's got enough, but you can't go out that way. Let me go for the laser underneath. Oh my god, can base scroll steal the game? Oh, criminy! Oh, Jesus Christ, base run, trash unreal here, they're running away with Red's cause. Red is unhappy, Bunny. Base gets a reflex kill. Can he get past them? He's nearly past them. He's running away. He's running for home. Base score is in here with the steel. Can he move it? He's just about surviving right now. He's running for his dearest goddamn life. He might better win the game from here. Blue team might steal this game right now. And right now, the looks of it, I think. There he goes. I think he's all over now. And Congas to victory. Nicely done. Now, okay, 42 seconds. Now, Red have a chance to counter steal here. Although, I think Blue's going to steal even more energy. <laughs> I'm just going to bankrupt you for reasons. <laughs> now, Red Team has got to try and steal the intel in 22 seconds, and Blue Team is just too busy celebrating right now to care. Chuck Steak is making absolute efforts and pains to try and get to it, and <laughs> it emerges to find the entire Blue Team in the way. Oh my god, what is this fabulous steal going on here? <laughs> Oh, well, I'm not sure who that was, but that reset the timer. That was amazing. And now it's like there's a robot that's actually writing stuff onto a clipboard and getting things ready. Is like a shuttle or something? Is this the afterlife? Where do we go from here? GPK's in there, he's trying his best. The M2 power is strong with enemy enemy team. No, nope, they're not letting him get close. And Robin wins the game. The team Robin, not actually Robin. Anyway, guys, I think that's enough for today of um, uh, commentary in Asteroid. Uh, you know, thank you very much for coming along, and I hope you like the map. So it's a bit short today, but I think, uh, generally speaking, I don't think people are that happy with it. And I thought, you know, maybe it's best to leave it here for now. And perhaps also reboot the server back into pub mode. Uh, that way you guys can enjoy, you know, auto-balancing and things like that. But... Okay, any case though, uh, most Dom's EU goes to uh, Zydran who managed to get four, and in terms of unluckiest player, well, I don't know, I think everybody who joined in expecting a much better game. But, you know, I still think this is a great game, and I do like Asteroid, and I still think there's plums depth to go with this game. In any case, guys, 
I'll see you in a minute because I'm going to restart this and join in. Bye.